Oh my God. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Black Rain. Hey, Black Rain. Uh, lean, lean, and stick don't stop. Black Rain, skill time, cause the gun won't pop. Mass pain, stop once, and your man gon' stop. Black Rain, stop twice, and they all gon' flop. Tryna play for a dub, but I don't even need it. You catch on me 50, you sound conceited. I still done so bad that he think that I cheated. You said you was pro when I win, you deleted. My diamonds, they rain on me, I'm undefeated. The top of 100, I don't even read it. My rank, you won't beat it, don't make me repeat it. RGA, the squad, man, don't get them boys either. All right, so as y'all can see, man, um, eight-game winning streak. I have the Patriots to play with next. Um, show you guys what I've been doing, man. Pretty much winning. Um, Raiders, Rams, Ravens. Took a loss with the Saints. My first game I played with the Saints, took a loss, came back with a nice win. Um, but other than that, these have been disconnection losses. So you guys see 21 losses on my record. I do not have 21 real losses. I have, like maybe 10 real losses and like 11 disconnection losses but i'm gonna set up the um who am i playing with the patriots I'll set up the patriots roster and see what we can get done man uh mac jones damon harris oh my god holy shit it's gonna be tough man 91 88 88 speed jesus christ um, I don't know who I'll start right there. Uh, whatever. Um, left in one sky. Did you guys? Where, hold on, where's Chase Win? All right, I'm about to say bro. And then Lawrence guy. Um, yeah, I don't know. D tackle might be Lawrence guy. Yeah, let's do it like that. All right, linebackers. Judon has a superstar. What does he have? Demoralizer. Defense building with clear of ball carriage progress towards entrance zone with a histic tackle. Edge threat. Okay, so he needs to be my outside edge rusher. Bam. So he needs to be my my D liner. Cool. Alright. He's definitely not playing a linebacker. Dante Hightower. Okay, we got an 88 speed linebacker right there in case I need to use him. Um Kyle Van Noy. Okay, uh shit. I really don't. All right, let me see. It sucks setting up rosters like this, but it is what it is, man. JC Jackson has what? Acrobat and pick artist. Wow, okay. Um, Devin McCourtney has pick artist and unfakeable. Okay. Okay, I might can work with this. All right, let's see. Sub linebackers first. So I got McCourtney, Kyle Duggar, um, uh, let's see. Okay, cool, cool, cool. 89 and 90 speed linebackers. Then the slot, we're going to have Sean Wade. And we're going to have, hmm. Let's go Adrian Phillips. At corner, we're going to go, we're going to go JC Jackson. And then right here, we're gonna go with Jalen Mills. Then right here is safety, we're gonna go, we're gonna keep you, McCourtney, right there. And then right here is where we're gonna put uh, John Jones. Bam, so let me see how this looks real quick. Jason Jackson, Mills, he's being used, he's being used. Bam, I kinda like that. All right, third down back, we're gonna go Damon Harris, power back Damon Harris. Slot receiver is going to be Kendry Bourne. Kendry Bourne played on Eastern Washington with Cooper Cup, in case you guys did not know. Um, they destroyed us. They didn't destroy us. We beat them in that game, but <laughs> they did whatever. They, they destroyed our DBs. They destroyed our defense, put it that way. Can't just say our DBs because I was out there trying to guard them too. And shit was crazy. All right, everything looks. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. When I go three, three, five wide, we need it. We need to put somebody here, and that's gonna be Cody Davis. Bam, perfect. So that's my lineup. Now I don't know if you guys recall. Oh shit, 
Um, I don't know if you guys recall, but I said I was getting tired of playing the same people. So I'm I'm currently recording this game at 1.42 a.m. Just trying to get some different comp. Um, I keep playing the same people on PlayStation, but just trying to run into some different people, man. Um, 85 overall, 85 defense, 78 offense, not too bad. Honestly, not I was not expecting that. They're definitely not a great Madden team that people would use, but we'll we'll just have to see. About time, bro. I looked up finally. I've been sitting here for five minutes and 21 seconds to get into a game, and I know it's 2 a.m., but I know somebody playing Madden. But um Check this out. Y'all ever wondered now, don't don't think I'm weird or judge me after asking this question or or don't don't judge or don't think it's weird or crazy because I'm really curious about this. Fuck, he's about to man me up. Oh god, but I really been wondering this, man. Y'all ever wondered how somebody gets shot 8, 9, 10 times and live? Like, yeah, bro, he got shot 9 times, bro. He's living, thank God. Like that ain't that ain't normal. Like, you, and you ever thought about like the process? Like, like say somebody gets shot nine times, and then you, think about how long somebody got to call the ambulance. Let's say the ambulance take two three minutes to get there. You like imagine somebody just sitting there just got shot nine times. With, that's just the the think about that. Like it just. Is that not crazy? Like, and people be living like, like people get shot nine times and live. Like all it takes is for your heart to stop beating and that's it. Like it's it's over with. But people will get shot eight, nine times and live. Like, I don't feel like that's normal. Like that ain't, like these people are blessed, but at the same time, it's like, Jesus Christ. And then, um, that's how you shoot the gap. And th th what made me think about that, because my homie, he's locked up right now. Um, he locked up. And what I, I, I've already told the story before, but I'll tell the story again. Um, he uh, said that he was on the way. Now, this is the same story he's been telling me for years now. So, I mean... I feel like he's telling the truth. I mean, he's been sentencing everything for a while now, and I feel like, oh my God, that's a terrible read. But I feel like, you know what I'm saying, this is what happened. You know what I'm saying? The only thing I can do is go off of his word. But, oh my God, I do not want to be on the fucking D-line. Cross is going to be wide open. And he still called it. I've learned with that animation right there, they're always going to catch that. But um, he said him and his homeboy was going to buy some weed from this, from the, the weed man, pretty much. And he said that uh, while they was there, the boys got in an argument. Him and his his homeboy and the weed man ended up getting into an argument. And he said um, and he said um, they ended up fighting. The homeboy and the weed man end up fighting. And um, he said while they was fighting, he was just sitting back chilling, like really just, because it was a one-on-one -on -one fight. He said he just sitting there watching them fight, really. I was supposed to be a man-to-man -man right there, but don't look like none of my guys was in man-to-man. -man. But he say them boys, they end up fighting, and before he knew it, he just sitting there watching, and all of a sudden, he said them boys are sitting there, they, they, they're in arm's length, shooting each other. They're in arm's length having like a legit shootout. Did he catch that? Let's go, no feet down. So he said them boys is like both grabbing each other's shirt and shooting each other. He said one dude got shot 12 times, one dude got shot 10 times. The dude that got shot 12 times ended up living. And the guy that got shot 10 times ended up dying. But he said, I knew he was going to throw that. Oh, 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 this game is bad. Holy shit, this game is bad. But he say, um, 
And the weed man is the guy that ended up getting shot 12 times and living. So he said when the, the dude that I'm living and testifying against him and pretty much said that they was in there to rob him pretty much. So he ended up getting time. Um, he said he tried to he tried to pill it or whatnot, and it's just everything. Nothing went his way. Like the the guy just said they was in there to rob him, and and the reason I asked that, and the reason I said that too, but that dude got shot twelve times and lived. Got shot twelve times and was like, and was able to tell his side of the story of what happened. Like, you got shot twelve times, bro. Like, I don't think you should be thinking clear. After being shot 12 times, he, they said he's like, they explained the story perfectly of how it went and everything. And I was just like so confused. Like, oh my God. And my homeboy ended up getting shot. Uh, my homeboy that's in prison right now ended up getting shot in the neck. He still got the bullet in his neck right now. He said he went to the crib after getting shot and just. <laughs> He went to the crib after getting shot and just like he said, bro, I got I got to the crib and I just got on the game and smoked me a blunt. I said, bro, with a bullet in your neck, he said, with a bullet in my neck, bro. He said, uh, he said, and I would have never got caught, but the only is that a good read? Ooh, no, we didn't get that feedback. He said, the only reason I got caught is because I ended up going to the hospital because my other roommate kept complaining that I should go and see the see the doctor. He said, bro, I feel perfectly fine. He said, but I just had to go to the doctor because I had a bullet in my neck. And I said, bro, that is crazy. So right now he said, and he said, if they, they told me that if they were to take it out, I will be paralyzed. He said, so here I am sitting here in prison still with a bullet in my neck. I said, bro, that is the craziest shit ever. He said, bro, he said, he said, I know I probably would've ended up getting caught, but I would've had time to get my stuff together. He said, but bro, I was chilling, playing the games. He said, I didn't, you know what I'm saying? Stop the blood or whatnot. He said, but the bullet was just in there. He said, I could feel it, but like, it wasn't really affecting me like that. He said, my roommate was complaining, bro, you need to go and get that checked out, bro. That ain't good. That ain't, he said, but I didn't even feel it. And I said, damn, that is crazy as hell. I didn't expect them to go man to man right there. But I was like, man, I feel for you, brother. That's just, that's just crazy. That's just absolute nonsense. Do y'all feel like, do, do, for y'all that play, that play PlayStation, do y'all feel like PlayStation like real glitchy? Like, it's hard for me to ask y'all that question because y'all don't play Xbox, so y'all don't know what the Xbox is supposed to feel like. But this shit is so glitchy. Gilmore can't get there. Oh, my God. I feel like if I possession catch that, I can actually catch that. But I, then again, I don't know. I should take my three points right here because he's manning me up. And this is not gonna be good. Mm. This ain't gonna be good. But hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. Good ball, rain. Good ball. Great run. Great run. Oof. I wanted to play that so risky right there. I really did, but just not the time and not the place, man. But um, do y'all feel like that's like it's it's crazy that people get shot that many times and live? Like another story, I know this guy. He was a rapper, local rapper from actually around where I am now, and um, 
he ended up getting shot 10 times and the story came out, he got shot um, in the head twice. He got shot in the head twice and in the body eight times and actually ended up living. And the shit's crazy because, you know what I'm saying, he was a, he was a rapper and after like, after he like recovered and everything, he showed the process and everything he had to go through, learning how to walk again. He showed him in the hospital bed, connected to all these tubes and stuff. It was pretty sad to see, but he said, um, he, he's made a full recovery now. He can legit walk again. He showed himself on Instagram, uh, going on jogs and like, still like, and he's back to rapping now. So like he's talking back perfectly fine and everything. And I'm just sitting here wondering like, that must be tough. Like tough to know that you're a strong person and that you're blessed. And at the same time, it's like you took 10, but in another situation, like, you know, somebody else who probably got shot one time and died. It's, it's crazy to even think about. And they'll tell you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't even know how it's explainable. Like, stuff like that is... That shit's not even supposed to be explainable. It, it's not explainable. Like, I don't understand how... And it's not for me to understand, but it's wild and crazy. Oh, my fucking God, bro. This game is nuts. For me to have a deep half player over there and they act like they don't see him over there. I guess that's why I usually like to blitz this tight shit. It's literally why I blitz the tight stuff. Did y'all see that my did y'all see my play art? Did y'all see my defensive play art? It was hard flat. And it's even crazier to me because we're close to the line of scrimmage. We're already down to the line of scrimmage. It's not like we're playing way back here and got to run up to the hard flat. We were literally right there at the hard flat. How do you throw, how do you throw a route in the hard flat when I have somebody, play? and I don't use zone drops, so it's default zone, it's default. He should be fucking picking that shit off. And who the fuck is this back here for kick return? This game, this game is nuts. This game, it's all, bro. I, and on the corner route up there, I have a deep half player. How's he getting over? I don't know, man. It should, I don't know how people try to explain this shit. Oh my, you better have clicked off because I was doing you dirty. There's so many people I really want to throw that ball to, bro. It's amazing that I'm finding myself in this situation and not throwing it. Like, I really want to be risky and throw all these passes that you see me. That you, like, you're like, okay, he's open right there, right? You should throw I want to throw it so bad, bro. Every single time I want to throw it. And I'm not throwing it. And I'm just, I don't know how I'm not, but. Do I throw the RPO? That RPO looks so damn good. That RPO looks so damn good, bro. That RPO looks mm, scrumptious. And I knew he wouldn't have time to put nothing over there because I'm quick hiking him under two minutes. But this is this is looking like this this is looking like it's a ball game. But I hope nobody taking what I'm saying the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just trying. I'm just. I just be sitting here thinking like, when I see like an Instagram post, such and such shot eight times, survived, such and such shot. This, and I'm just wondering like, yo, is they getting shot with airsoft guns or what? Or is like, or are people really this strong? Because like, cause like I said, you'll see situations where people, oh my God, not on, 
you see situations where people get shot once or twice and, and won't make it. And you'll be like, damn, that's unfortunate. But when I seen that story about dude getting shot in the head twice and the body eight times. It's like. It's, it's crazy. How do you. What do you even say about that? Like if you're somebody like, like not trying to be funny or trying to anything, but let's say you're the person who did the shooting. It's like, damn. It's like, when you, you know, you, you knew you went there to do a job and you know you did a job to best your ability. What the fuck is the point of a cloud, bro? What is the point of a cloud if somebody can throw a slant right behind it? Or right right beside it? Like, what is the point? Seriously. Middle of the field is wide open. Thank you. Let's get that. Let's get that. Middle of the field is wide open on that post of Robert Anderson if he got time to throw it. But one thing I know about Carolina, if you blitz Cam... He gonna throw some inaccurates like that. But once again, man, I'm just trying to, I ain't trying to be rude or disrespectful or nothing to nobody. I'm just curious on like, the, the world is a crazy place, man. The world is literally a crazy place. Like I've already told this story too. Um, I had a, um, a roommate in college. A uh, story came out, he was sitting, he was just came home from a friend's house like 12 o'clock at night. Um, had not been drinking or nothing. Was sitting at a was sitting at a at a red light, waiting on to turn green. There was a guy running from a police officer on a high speed chase. Ended up uh, crashed into him while he's sitting at that stoplight and killed him. And, and just killed him like. Imagine you sitting there texting on your phone, just waiting on the light to turn green, and all of a sudden you just, that's it. That shit's, I, that shit's crazy. Like, tw how old was, how old was this shit? 22, 20, he was 20, like, he was like 23, 24 years old. I just could not imagine. I just could not imagine, bro. Like a perfect dude, bro. Was never in no trouble, never just a solid dude. And shit like that just happened. I don't even, there's no explanation for it. There's nothing you can say to justify it. There's, there's nothing like that's just, tsk. shit's crazy. I am dotting this dude's face off and I know he hates it. Like I can feel that he is like, he really don't know what to play. He really don't know what defense to get in right now. Cause I'm mixing in the run with these passes. He's just on his hip. That's what, this is what you call on your heels. He is on his heels right now. What a bro! He is, he is like he don't he he don't know how to explain this shit. It's just like the situation, bro. He this is nothing you can explain. Like we picking up blocks, we are playing amazing right now. Except for the little run throughs he's getting like that. This is it. Don't get too much better than this. It really don't. I'm putting together shit like this. 
Oh my God. Mm. You know what's crazy right here, bro? I'll take my three points. I don't need to play nothing risky as I'm finna throw this dot right here, the triangle. As I'm finna throw this dot right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as I finna throw the fucking laser right here, the triangle, dog. <laughs> as I say that, I come out and I, and that was a predetermined read too. Like I ain't gonna say it was predetermined, but I I knew I was gonna, I was looking to throw that, and when I ran whatever with the go route that I knew was gonna be open, I said, oh my goodness, because I've been no. I've been noticing he's been in cover three, so that should be open. I've just been running the normal route combinations to try to open up different stuff, but that is crazy. All right, here comes the deep crosser. We're going to put a half back. Look, McCourt. Okay, no, he's running the ball. Cool. Just make the tackle. Perfect. But this is the formation he ran that deep crosser out of uh, the first possession of the game, and he didn't catch it. This is what I'm running so you guys can see. Oh, so he had the crosser. That is nuts. Oh my God. I don't even know what that route is. It's like a post or something. That shit's nuts though. I need to start blitzing that formation. Next time I see that shit. Next time I see that shit, I'm blitzing it. I can't believe he threw that pass right there and my dude was just uh, timeout. Nope, 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 nope. He's in tight. We need to blitz this. We definitely need to blitz this. Cam. Okay, gun. Okay, we, we, we can man this right here up, though. We can man this up. I got the crosser from Robbie. Oh yeah, let me get that. It's Cam. He's gonna throw passes like that. It's it's the Panthers. It's the Panthers. And what I've been trying to explain to people is when you play Mutt and you play Regs, it's so different because you play you play with the Panthers to like pretty much signify the man to man and the DBs that they have in Mutt. You know what I'm saying? Like these, this is as close to your 99 speed DBs as you're gonna get pretty much with the Panthers. But on the other side of the ball, you, you look at your quarterback, Cam Newton, Sam Donald. You, there's not a ability you can just say, well, let me go ahead and put Slinger on the Panthers and I'll be good. It don't work like that. Like you can do in Mud. And Mud, you pick what abilities you want to put on these players. And in Riggs, it don't work like that. Oh my God, I should've threw, that's bad. That's bad, that's bad. I should've threw my go route outside to, uh, to, to Aguilar. He had Dante cooked off the line of scrimmage and if I threw it right then and there, it would've been perfect. Like that right there. Oh my God. Oh man. I just knew we had that. I know Dante has makeup speed, but I just figured the ball would just. Mm, that's pretty good defense. No, don't give no. We did not want to give up a quick run like that. Not fast. Not off of a turnover and then a, Yeah, that's not good. We definitely did not want to turn the ball over on one play and then give a touchdown the very next play. Mm. Oh my God. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> it's always me like getting caught from somebody else. If it's your user, I'm gonna do you dirty every single time. But there's always somebody back there, the hustle player of the year. He want me to run the ball so bad. And you know what? So he can run down from right there and shoot the gap. 
But you know what? That's literally what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna run the ball, but we're gonna get in single back doubles. I'm gonna run it. I'm gonna run it. I'm not finna go, yeah, I'm gonna run it. And some people might call this dumb. Me too, well, not dumb, but some people might call this not playing, you know what I'm saying? Some people might say, hey, you're running this. That's that's playing scared. You chewing clock? No, that's playing smart. Me chewing clock. Me chewing clock is playing smart. And he's not in the defense to be back there like that and trying to come through and shoot the gap because my center is still just picking him up. It's because I'm running inside zone now. But if I run trap. He's gonna run right behind my pulling guard and go make the play. So you gotta just really figure out what your opponent's saying and which runs are best to run based on what he's. Like for an example, when I run this right here, he's gonna run right behind that left guard and come through and make the tackle. Bam, just like, you know what I'm saying? Something like that. But if I run read option, where my people are supposed to climb up to him, we should be good. Oh, he sent a little. He sent a little heat. He sent a little heaty heat right there, though. Sent a little heaty heat. And I'm I'm chilling right now. I'm I'm not gonna pass the ball. I'm gonna run the ball again. And you know, if I don't get it, I'll take my three points. Let them boys get settled over there. <clears throat> Backside in that box. Backside and got in that box. Can't tell me you just got beat by the Patriots, bro, with the Panthers. There's there's no way in hell nobody in this world, I ain't gonna say nobody in this world, but it's, it's, it'll be tough for somebody to get the Patriots and beat me with the Panthers. Bro, I will man your ass up all game and there will be nothing you can do about it, bro. Nothing. And it's not like you can just take the, the Patriots and man up the Panthers. They got the Patriots got a couple fast DBs, but you ain't supposed to nah. Play, if you play this game, what really messed him up was that first drive where Robert Anderson dropped that pass. He didn't even drop it. They just even they didn't even give him a chance to even catch it. But that that kind of messed him up. But this is what we're running around here. We're sending a little heat at Cam. We sent a little heated camera. I can't let you run these crosses, bro. I just can't. We got to live with a throw out of sack or something. He tried a nice little sneaky run right there. He tried a nice little sneaky run. That's smart to do versus the blitz. Run the ball versus the, uh, versus the blitz. That's smart. We got something for you, though. How? How? I have him in a deep fourth. How is he beating me and he's in a deep fourth? How? He was thinking it was cover two, which is, I see, this game is so crazy. He's gonna throw it to Robert right up the seam. Let's do it like that. I like that. He's manned up. Nope. Let me get that. Let me get that. Get up, boy. It's great defense. Great defense, Rain. That's how you think? Great defense, Rain. Uh-oh, here comes the heat. I'm actually surprised that we blocked that long. Like, these dudes be blocking for real. Their offensive line must be pretty good. I need to go and check out their offensive line. It gotta be pretty good or something. I just got a message from, I just got a message, um, Mikey. Never thought I would run into you, GG, bro. I'm just mad I lost to the slow-ass pass. Laugh out loud. Damn, got to get better. <laughs> Damn. 
GG's, bro. But yeah, man, like I said, that's why I'm playing the game at uh, 2 a.m. right now, just so I can run into some different people. But he messaged me fast. That was that was quick. Uh, 105 and 75, 18. Score 19 points, give up 13. Um, and he's in a custom playbook 95% of the time. So <clears throat> y'all know how I feel about custom playbooks. I just I just be wanting to let people know that all right, he's in the custom cool. I just cut it off right there. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna keep complaining about the customs, but we just gonna we just gonna let it be known. Uh 79 offensive line, 76, 84, 87, 86. Okay, shit. 86, 84, 87. And 76 and 79. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Offense line's yeah. Offense line's good for real. Offense line is is yeah. Okay. I got uh Candyman HMFL and he is coming with the Saint uh <laughs> I was about to say the Saints. The Falcons. What made me literally just sit here and say the Saints? I have no clue. Boy just really sat up here and said he got the Saints. So he really wanted to come out and gun stack because I didn't switch it up and he didn't really went back to gun stack again. So um, let's see. What you got for me in gun stack? What you got for me? What you got up your sleeve, brother? Okay, motion back to something else. We still shooting gaps. Come on, Madden. Come on, come on. We just came through and smacked Cordero in his mouth. Knocked that boy mouthpiece out. What you got for me? What you? Okay, so I should put him in a hard flag. Cordero probably got a drag. Oh, he got the He's in a hard flat, ladies and gentlemen. That left corner is in a hard flat. I don't know how he caught that, but he did. So I see he got two whip routes on both sides. Okay, cool. Hmm, two whip routes on both sides. Gotcha. Nice little third and one run. Okay, okay. So I see you playing serious, cause third and one, you gonna really get up under that center. And, okay, cool. Let's set up a little 340 then. So next time you try to do some shit like that, we be knocking at your door waiting on it. Go ahead and set our shit up proper. Real, real dealio. So we be prepared for it. Good ball. Who is that? Is that, is that Calvin Ridley who caught that? See, I don't know if y'all be knowing or not, but I like to come out and man the man at first just to see what route combinations I'm gonna get. And then from that, that'll let me know what zones I need to be in. That'll let me know exactly what kind of zones I need to be in after I figure out what route combinations to do like the run. But once I figure that out, we good. Nice corner route. You predeterminedly threw that because you already knew he was gonna snap him off. Okay, cool. I was like, I didn't go out there to play that because I'm figuring he's not gonna throw that at all. But he already knew he was gonna snap him off. And that's respect, okay. I like that. Ooh, nice play. Nice play right there. It's a run. He clicked on his offensive line and we're run committing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Hike the ball, bro. Hike it. We was going, even though I was run committing, I wanted to get through there and shoot that gap myself. I wanted to be the one. But that's what we get for being too impatient. Look at him on his, he said click, click on his offensive line. We're run committing. We don't care. And it was almost a fucking disaster, bro. Almost a disaster. This game is crazy. Okay, so when, when I run commit, I'm going to just keep my user and I'm going to just stay in the middle of the field. I'm going to just stay there. And then once we figure out what's going on, then I'm going to just click off of my user to try to go make the tackle because me shooting the gap and, and yeah, that shit's pointless, bro. That shit's just mad and stupid.
This is perfect defense right here. Probably a corner out on his right side. Are you running the ball? Good defense. Great defense. I hope I didn't scare anybody off with my talks earlier. Um, I really just be having regular conversations like that inside of my head. I'd be just curious. Corner route, you already ran that. Dig, I'm on that shit. Oh my God. Oh my God. You see what I'm saying? Once you figure out what route combinations people like to run, then you can start jumping shit and actually playing it. Like I've seen that formation. You know what I'm saying? You gotta study the formations and whatnot and what route combinations. Call the corner out on me already. We've seen that before, bro. Like I, I'm knowing what you want to throw. Once I go and take away one route, now I've already took away all you, the only way you're gonna throw that is on the break. You take away the break throw. Oh, I can't throw that shit. Now you look for your next read and he don't see me. He's already thinking I'm already committed to that route right there. But all I really wanted to do was take away the initial, the initial right there. As soon as you break, you can't throw it. Now you're gonna look for something else. And now I'm gonna look for something else. Bam, you come across, go pick that off. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh shit, what is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Is he sending the heat? I don't, did y'all see how uh, Matt Jones threw that pass? Like he threw it like kinda high and over the top so that, that was kinda neat. I like how he threw that. Uh. Hey, celebrate on the rain. Celebrate, so what he's doing, is he rushing four or is he rushing five? I can't tell how many he's rushing, but the way he's doing it, he's bringing that line back up into the gap. So that, like, if he can rush through, he's going to come through himself, too. But once he gets stopped, now he's going to back up and guard some shit real quick. And that's when you just sit in the pocket and just trust your offensive lineman that you're sitting behind because them boys is 80 overalls and 79s. And you feel me? Just trust the offensive line, man. Got to have big trust. And Mac Jones is actually out there like he's, poof. I'm loving it, Mac. Good hit stick. Dietrich Wise Jr. Good hit stick. You, yeah, you. I actually met this guy before. Uh, one of my friends played for the Patriots, Derek, uh, Derek Rivers. And these two was pretty much competing for a spot. They both came out at the same time. And I went up to Boston and I got to meet him. Dude is, bro. And when I say dude is huge, dude is huge. Running back, nice. I forgot Cordero got um, backfield master. Mm. That's interesting. That is very, very interesting. Very, very interesting. No, no, no. Does does Matt Ryan got slinker or some shit? Cause that ball is getting there pretty fast. And I really ain't appreciating it. Like this is what I'm playing. I got a hook right there, but the hook is not actually playing the hook. Like I don't know what I want him to play, but I want him to Yeah, ain't shit open. Let me get that up off you. Appreciate you. The only time that route over there on the left side is open, it's off the initial break. Take off the initial break, and then you got time to go and play other shit. But until then, you know, until you can go play other shit, you gotta take care of that initial, that initial route first. You do that, and you good. I like playing against people like this that actually like to blitz. Because when you blitz and we pick it up, that means you don't have a lot of people in coverage. I really, I really like it. Uh, late hit. Roughing the passes, yep. And I had triangle wide open again too. 
little spot route right there. Could have threw that, but that's a throw that we can make every single time. Man to man. Um, let's see. <laughs> I'm six for six with the Patriots, bro. If by this time you guys don't think now I lose games every now and then, you know what I'm saying? But if by this time you guys don't think I can play with every single team, bro, like it's crazy. Like if you think I need a certain this or a certain that to be successful by this time, it's 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 crazy. By this time, you should be like, all right, yeah, Ryan can definitely, definitely play. Like he don't need, he don't need that. He didn't gotta have that. By this time, you gotta understand that, like, I'm just gonna make a read. By this time, you gotta understand that I'm gonna identify the defense. Once I identify the defense, I'm gonna put the correct offensive play on the field. And then once I do that, you feel me? It's up to me to just make the read. And I'm pretty, nine times out of 10, I'm gonna make the right read. Cause I already identified the defense. Then offensively, I, I it's it's crazy, it's, it's crazy, bro. It's it's something that you can't explain. <laughs> and then on defense, once I figure out your route combinations out of certain formations, I'm gonna start putting out there different defenses to. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. And now that I got you down 14 and zero, you really need to pass the ball now. So what I'm really gonna do. Is blitz you. What I'm really finna do is blitz you. Now. Oh, you run the ball? That is crazy. That is crazy. I really thought he was gonna. I really thought it was a pass. I really thought he would come out past the ball, but I read him wrong right there. Really thought he would come out past the ball. Hell no, hell no, to the no, no. Yo, you got that tripping? Get up, my boy, get up, get up, get up. <laughs> Let's see, what you got for me now, broski? What you got for me now? Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> Come on, hike it. Don't let them set up shit. Hike it. And we ain't gonna risk it. We got Matt right there. We ain't gonna risk it. We're really finna try some shit. But I decided now. Nah. We're going to try that shit right here. We're going to try that shit right here. Mm. Oh, my God. Bad ball, Matt. Bad ball, Matt. Bad ball. Now, we can't go let him score. That's what we can't go do. Cool, cool. I wanted that ball, like, deep, like, deep down the middle of the field. Deep. Ah. <sighs> We ain't mad about that though. We ain't tripping about that. We that was something we was trying. This is what we're looking like right here though on defense. Oh my user fail. <clears throat> oh my user fail. Oh my user fail. I was gonna be playing that too. We just gave up three points. We ain't tripping on it though. We we cool. <laughs> All right, time out, time out. Either this game is very, very bad, or my stick work is just very, very good. Cause I was literally just sitting right there playing tag with the computer. Me and the computer sat there and played tag. And he couldn't touch me. And this is tackle football. That ain't that. Come on now. 
this is not good me being a five wide because he can literally bring six people. I'm gonna have to make that quick of a read every single time. Um, let's see, who is his user on? That's just Mike Kim right there then. That's Mike Kim. Bam, all right, we're good. Cause he ain't gonna blitz that guy off the right side. He ain't gonna do that. So we just slide away from him, we good. Mike Kim. I don't know what, bro, Mac Jones is crazy, bro. Out of range, that's what it is. He's out of, he, he can't throw that far. That's literally what it is. I knew I wanted that post at, and he couldn't get, that's what it is. Okay, cool. I see. I see what's going on. Step away from the blitz, and then we fucked the liver to die right there. Couldn't. Yeah, it's not good me being a five wide. I already, I already knew that. We just out here experimenting now, though. Just like I tried to tell y'all, I'm out here trying to make for content now, but it's all good. It is all good. We can go back to what we know. We can go back to what we know, man. We ain't gotta be out here experimenting. We know it work. I should be blocking one of these people. His blitz gonna get through, probably. Yep. Two people. Yep. Yep. Great ball. All you gotta do is block the right amount of people that he's blitzing, and then you're good to go. Man to man. At least I think it's man to man. We're gonna do something like this. It was man to man. I was throwing triangle with the slant. I don't know how it was gonna go. Looked it kind of good though. The slant looked like it was gonna be good, but if it would have been a throw out of sack or something crazy, then you just never know. So this is a terrible route combination. I don't even know what this is, but mm, nice playmaker, Rain. Nice playmaker, Rain. Mmm. Nice playmaker. Man to man, hike it. Hike it, hike it. Corner out. Ugh. Corner out. AJ Trail. Too small, boy. Small fry, boy. You feel me? Boy, you small fry, boy. Keep running, bro. Come on, bro. Hey, I see you. You see me. Keep keep running, bro. He worried about that playmaker over there. I ain't thinking about that playmaker. I know what I want to throw. Keep running. Come on now. Mm, don't really like this coverage. Oh, my God, Rain. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Rain. You playing that shit like that, bro? You playing that shit like that? Hell yeah, we playing all that shit. Even though he's manned up, he would he would have caught that pass too, for sure. Don't know what coverage that is you're in, bro, but that is not good coverage. I don't know what the fuck that was. Cover three, I, that couldn't have been cover three, or I just glitched out your I just glitched out your third player or something. I don't know what I can't begin to explain. I just said that by. 30 times this video. I can't begin to explain how that felt. Mm -mm. This game crazy. All right, let's see. I know I don't have a left corner over there. Um, corner route, running back, post. None of that shit is supposed to be open at all, bro. Come on, man. He done ran that same route combination out of that formation. All he know is what he know out of these route formations. Well, out of these formations. All he know is what he know. Whip route, whip route, double whip routes on both sides. We're on that, we're on that. We have something right there for that too. Perfect. All he know is the same. Once I figure out these route combinations, bro. Y'all remember when I said earlier, I said I have a hard flat over there for that whip route. 
So what I did right there, I put a hard flat on that side for the whip route. I put a hook curl right here for that dig. I went and played that whip route over there myself. And he must did not see my hook curl right there for the dig. Identify route combinations and then you can put out the defense that you want to put out there on the field. That's all you got to do, man. Identify what you already know he's going to run. You just put the route shit out there for him to play. You know what I'm saying? That's what I be mad about. I'm like, yo, I know what he's running. I have him in. Y'all hear me say, yo, I got a, a flat over there. I ain't got a flat for no fucking reason. I put a flat over there because I pretty much know what's going to come. Now, I haven't seen this route coming. I haven't seen this formation, so I really don't know what to expect. Oh, I think that was the glitch. I think that was the glitch formation where you can fake it and throw the, the RPO right there and he'll be wide open, but we got a cloud over there for that. I don't know what he was thinking with that one, but you have a stop route right in front of your post. That's just not smart football. Actually, I need him to go that way so I can shoot this gap. Mm. Smart play. Smart play, fullback dive. Imagine it being 3 a.m. and you getting fucking hounded by black rain. <laughs> Fucks rain doing on this time of night. Rain should definitely not be on this time of night. I knew that corner, I knew the out route that, that route was coming, but at the same time, bro, I scooted my people outside to try to prevent that so I could go and play something else and it really didn't matter. Good ball, great ball. Look at this defense. Actually, I don't like that because there's nobody on him, but I'm gonna play that myself. Wow, I got my hand on triangle. Just didn't let me pick it. I have double clouds on the field right here. Even though it's probably a running situation. Still got double clouds on the field. Okay, why is he man up on him? Cool. I like this. If it's for if it's a pass, I like this. Jesus Christ. I shoot the gap and I try to click off to let the dude go and make the tackle. And he just acts blind. Who 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 who, who, got, who got the ball? Him? him? Like, you, you see him, bro. He's right there. Double. Um, yeah. I don't know why I like to get down here and, like, legit set up pass defense. Like, I'll set up pass defense on fourth and, fourth and inches on the goal line. I'm setting up pass defense. That's just one thing I just cannot deal with. Somebody just legit passing the ball on me. Like, running the ball, cool. You can have that shit, right? That's just me personally, man. I just cannot. Because nine times out of ten, the people you run into are going to be passers, you know? So, if you got great pass defense, you can live with having okay or suspect run defense, you know? Even when, when you already know that the run on this game is OP. So, like, I, I just don't even like trying to waste my time trying to find run defense when I just really stick to worrying about pass defense. And that's my weakness. Run the ball on me, then you'll be kind of successful. But when you get in pass situations, I hope you really know what you're doing when you come when you go to pass the ball. Cause trust me, I'm gonna have some pass defense set up. The pass. Nice solid runs, man. Nice solid runs. I hate playing against people like this that late game, they start calling timeouts and shit. Bro, it's, it's too late. If you figured out something at, at this point in the game, it's too late. Like the game, the game been over, bro. 
it, the game is over. The game is over, bro. You out here really trying to play defense and run, committing shit. The game's over. <laughs> what are you? You should have been. You should have thought about. And look, you see what I'm saying? For what? For like literally for what? That's all I'm. That's all I'm curious about. It's three. It's three fucking a.m. You got anything better to do than sit here and call top? Bro, I know we both playing Madden at, at three a.m. But bro, I know you got something better to do than just sit here and call timeout to come out here and play like this. Come on, bro. Like seriously. All right, that dude was 200 and 140, um, scores 29 points a game, gives up nine. A little, little, little shaky, I don't know about that. But 47% uh, of the time is in a custom playbook, so. <laughs> but man, we on a 10 game win streak playing with random teams, man. But that right there was definitely a GG. Thank you guys for watching the video, next time. Peace. Hey, Brad Wayne, oh, yeah. Alright, let's do this. For daily sticky uploads, follow me at YT Black Rain 4 on TikTok. For hoodies and t-shirts, click the link down below in the description. Black Rain's bin. That's where you get all your gear at. For funny stories and motivational stories, follow me on Snapchat at Black Rain 4. And for the latest news on everything, follow me on Instagram at Black Rain 4. And last but not least, if you want to play anybody in Rain Gang, look down below in the description. All the information is down there that you need. You dig. You dig, you dig, you dig.